Hey, this is Ray Dombrowski. I was at the store today and I saw a really cool camouflage walk short. And I thought that actually it would be really easy to recreate that in Photoshop. And I'll show you how I do it. So what I'm gonna do is I, I'm gonna start out with um, a series of Photoshop brushes I have. And these are part of the Aquacolor series. And you can make your own watercolor brushes. And I, I have a video um, that I'll link to that shows you how to do that. But since I've already got these made, uh, it's gonna make it really easy. So first I will fill the background with kind of a base tan color. And then I like to work with my colors on separate layers. So what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm just gonna pick like a, like a green camo color and just start painting with that. And then maybe I'll pick another brush here. This particular set has a, uh, a number of different watercolor brushes, so you get a lot of variety with it. And you can scale these things up or down with your bracket keys. And it looks like the, uh, the camo I'm referencing has some black in it, so I'm gonna make a new layer. And I'm gonna pick you know what, I'm gonna make it a really dark brown, actually. That might look a little nicer. So I'll go in there, pick another brush. And the nice thing about these is there's a level of transparency. So you can see the color overlays that are created. And I'm gonna pick another brush, just to add even more variety. And maybe I will go in there with just a top layer of black. And the nice thing about these being in separate layers is I can actually go back and turn down the opacity of the black layer a little bit because it, it seems like it's a little overpowering. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. So what I'll do is I'll put this pattern in the free download of the week. I'll give you a link to that. If you miss that, I'll also put it into Graphic Design Launch Kit. And if you wanna make your own Photoshop brushes, I'll also put a link in to my video showing you how to do that. Thanks for watching.